How's it going, ladies and gentlemen of the YouTubes? We're back! We're back. With another video for you guys, another song reaction. This time we are doing Thy Art is Murder, Reign of Darkness, a deathcore classic. Uh, heard it a long time ago. It's been a few years since I've listened to it. So I'm kind of curious to see if I like it more now than I did in the past. Um, I don't think you've heard this before at all. Uh, I probably definitely have, but I don't remember anything about it. I definitely have, and I definitely liked it back in the day. I didn't, it wasn't like, you know, oh man, this is my favorite song, but I definitely liked it. So I'm curious to see if I like it now more that I've kind of expanded my, my taste and I've kind of paid attention more to the the actual, you know, the musical production aspect, I guess you can say, of of music, if that makes any sense at all. That probably sounds really stupid, and I don't apologize for it. Also, the name Thy Art is Murder is kind of stupid. Shouldn't it be Thine Art is Murder? <laughs> <laughs> That's been a whole debacle on the internet. Really? It has. Awesome. Well, I, I throw my hat in the thine <laughs> uh, army. Uh, if you support thine, like us and, and subscribe. And, and if send you support us. Thy, like us and subscribe. And, and send us millions of dollars so we can keep making these videos. Because the, the production cost is, is, is pretty pretty great yeah we're, we're averaging we're probably doing a couple things wrong but we're averaging about 36 million dollars a video right now at least yeah at least um we might have problems budget costs are but we do it for you thy art is murder reign of darkness here we go He said go for really long there, didn't he? Oh man, it's a fire. <laughs> oh, it's hot. I can't even exit off. Uh, screw it. You can feel the warmth. Oh. Okay. Looks like a nice sleeve going on there. Oh, what? Uh. Yeah, I was gonna say, you might wanna... Is she, uh... Try to eat a donut and just like. <laughs> this powdered donut's so good. <laughs> oh, I see a seven string. Up. Oh. Another seven string. The Here we go. The has the bass player on. Wipe that drool up.
Thy art is murder. Reign of darkness. Damn, I forgot how good that was. That was good. So, so you didn't like it? So, I liked parts of it. I don't like his growling. I like his screaming. Um, the guitar solo was boring. Uh, other than that, it's got that kind of chug and uh, deathcore essence. Yeah, it, my head was bobbing a little bit. Uh, it's got good things, but I guess maybe a little bit too. You can tell that it's an older video. Yeah, this this song, I want to say, two thousand eleven or twelve. I think twelve. Um, I really enjoyed it, and I remember liking it quite a bit back in the day. But yeah, I definitely forgot how much I liked it. So I've this might make it back into my daily playlist. Um, really like the drumming. The drumming was awesome. Gu the guitar solo was a little boring. I mean, it was kind of generic. Uh, the one thing that uh, bothers me in a really big way <laughs> is I believe it's the first real scream the singer is going like Raw, and he spreads his arms away but you still hear the Raw, and it's like that's not how microphones work it would be like Raw. <laughs> Yeah, um, obviously that's, you know, a music video, <laughs> but it's, yeah, it's still kind of a weird, weird thing that they didn't, you know, hey, this, why? <laughs> um, what did you think of the, uh, girls spitting water and saliva and blood and how did that relate to the lyrics? Which honestly, I didn't make a lot of the lyrics out because the growling was a little too extreme. Well, like there's growling and being able to enunciate and get words out there, and there's growling that is just growling, but like bands that are not able to convey words while they're growling do a good job of using the growling as like the chorus and keeping the words simple where this was trying to say a lot more i think yeah definitely personally i would have to look up the lyrics to figure out what entirely was said i mean if you're just going strictly off the video i guess you can kind of put together that this girl is like being possessed or she's being controlled by something hence like just her head being thrown back and blood and stuff being projected but i mean spewed possibly spewed i mean aside from that you can't really draw kind of a whole lot as to what <laughs> the lyrics are representing because they've got this weird like, abandoned it almost looks like they're on the moon <laughs> They've got this abandoned crater filled, gray filled place. They've got fire, and then they've got this girl sitting on a chair. Maybe she just won musical chairs or something. That's why she's the only one there. Maybe that's why she's so tired, too. Yeah. It can be physically what was demanding. What's the powdered donut thing? Yeah, I don't get what was. There was, it looked like powdered sugar was smeared all over her face. Like, I thought at first that it was, like, uh, decay and she was dead, but then she came back to life and things are just... I don't know. I have more questions than I had before the video. <laughs> Is that possible? Yes. Um, Music video aside, I think it was... If I can figure out what the lyrics are saying... Which is kind of, could, could we agree that good music, you shouldn't have to have a decoder ring to make out? I mean, yes and no. Some people just like heavier music, and they might not be good with even 
softer songs that are still heavy, you know, have growls and they don't necessarily have clean vocals. Some people just like that kind of music and they might not be able to understand it. So, if, oh, you know, I couldn't make out what all they said. I'm going to look it up. That's just kind of my thought about the issue. I mean... In an age when CDs are going away and albums are going away and singles are dominating the industry, like, it's not like you can just open up the album booklet and read. But you can thing. you can just go, Die Art is Murder, Reign of Darkness, and it, typically it, the is lyrics... Is that how you type into a keyboard? You, well, you actually <laughs> hammer fist... Um, but no, seriously, I mean, you can literally just type in, you probably just type in Reign of Darkness, and you might get lucky and it might pop up, but I mean, usually the song name and the band name, and either it'll pop up right in the first block of Google, or there'll be, a. there's like three main song websites, like ALZ Meanings, a couple main websites that have lyrics posted, and they're usually almost spot on, so... And half of them are violating the copyright law. Half of them are violating the copyright law. Um, but yeah. In, <laughs> in conclusion. Uh, a scale of one to seven. One to seven. I'd give it a six. It was a, a solid song. Very solid song. I enjoyed it. If I could understand the lyrics, it'd probably be a seven. It's a four for me. We're, we're climbing the ladder with you. <laughs> We're, 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 we'll get there. We'll get we'll get a song he likes eventually. Um, yeah, if we ever get around to uh, that hardest song ever written, Buddy Holly by Weezer, there's a solid ten. Foreshadowing. We'll, we'll get there by 2040, I promise. Maybe 2039 if we're lucky. Oh, uh, jeez. We're going to have to upscale this $36 million budget if that's the case. And on that bombshell, we will see you in the next video. Adieu.